hey y'all welcome back to my channel and this is another wig edition video are y'all loving this straight hair because i am so loving this straight hair You guys, I did order this hair from AliExpress, the same vendor I normally order all my hair from. But I'll leave all that info down in the description box down below. Um, You guys, if you're ready to see me slay this wig, just continue watching. So you guys, I didn't do a full tutorial on how to make a wig because I did that in the last video. But I'll make sure I leave that link down below of how I make my wig. So this is just like a run through of how I make it. Now you guys, when I sew my closures, I usually start from the right side and I sew it to the back part in the middle. And then I'll go to the left side and sew it to the back where it meets. And the reason why I do this is because if you kind of sew it all the way around, you'll kind of sew it crooked if you don't do it the right way. No, you guys I did not bleach the knots on this closure um, I just left it the same and I um, just sewed it right on the cap and now you guys I'm just uh, before I start flat ironing the wig I co-washed it so I just basically washed it with conditioner and let it air dry I didn't blow dry it out I just let it air dry and now I'm just basically flat ironing it And for those of you wondering, no, I did not use all three bundles. Uh, I tried to sew the the wefts as close as possible, but I didn't use all three bundles. I ended up using maybe two bundles and maybe I only had like a fourth left of the third bundle. And since this is a straight wig, I make sure I go over the top of the closure to make sure it lays flat because you don't want it not to lay flat since it is a straight wig but you guys this is how I normally braid my hair um and these braids have been in for like two weeks <laughs> but you just kind of throw the wig on and you don't want to put it all the way to the front of your hair you want to put it on and make sure it's lined up with your part but slide it a little towards the back because you want to make it look as natural natural as possible you guys then I add some foundation you can add foundation or anything as long as it matches your skin complexion and I add it to the closure part and also my part just so it can blend nicely Now once you're do done doing that, you comb it out and you slay, honey, because you're done. <laughs> but uh, thank you guys for watching this video. And um, you guys, if you have any questions, just comment down below and let me know. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.